Good morning. Hope everybody slept great. I told you videos are the way to go. It's so much easier for me to get something out over video than it is to sit down and write it. So hello. I'm glad we are here. And look, um, I'm really excited about just this thought today. So at CrossFit this morning, uh, there is this thing called a no rep in the game or the workout of CrossFit. And ultimately what a no rep is, it means like you tried the movement, but you didn't really do it. You kind of like half did it, maybe kind of did it, exerted partial energy doing it, but it doesn't really count. So you have to do it again. And this morning, there was a specific movement where we go from the ground overhead, and it has to hit the ground in order for it to count. Now, I know this, but I would be lying to you if I, if I didn't admit that probably like six of, I don't know how many we did, six out of 60, I, I did not hit the ground. I just didn't hit it. I just kind of swung it up, you know? And my coach walked by. He saw this. Dang it, I hate when I get caught. You ever hate when you get caught? So my coach sees this, and uh, he just walks by, and he's like, you know you're supposed to be hitting the ground. Well, I do what all of us do when we know we're supposed to be doing something, and we don't do it. And I'm like, I just pretend I don't hear it. <laughs> and, uh, and so he stops, and just like looks at me, and he's like, I know you heard me. <laughs> and then he walks away, and that was the end of the moment. But... I say all this because how many of us are doing this in our spiritual lives? You know, where God has given us a specific assignment. God has put us in a specific job. God has given us a specific role. And and we're doing it. But we're not really, like, working for the Lord. We're not doing it with everything that's in us. We're just doing it to say that we're doing the motion. But it's not counting. Um, and I think this can be frustrating because... There's a lot of us in seasons where we do the same thing over and over and over again. And we're like, God, why haven't you moved me forward yet? God, why am I not progressing? God, why does it feel like I'm doing the same thing over and over and over again? And friend, that's because you are. I mean, you are. And, and I think this is so true in our spiritual lives where God has asked us to do something and we're not giving it everything he's given us. We're giving it a little bit of focus. We're trying, you know, we're like, ah, I mean, it's happening, but I'm not really, I'm not really into it. I don't want to do it all the way. And then we're stuck in these cycles. And so I just want to encourage you today. If you feel stuck in a specific cycle, um, maybe you just feel like God is asking you to do the same thing over and over and over again. Could it be friend that like, it's just a no rep. It's not that you're not exerting the energy. It's not that you don't even know what to do. It's that you're not really doing it. And so I just want to challenge you, take that to the Lord, ask him what are those specific areas that, um, you know, that he wants you to do full out. And I promise that he will move in a big way and it will count and the workout will end. Um, you don't want to get no repped. Come on, guys. We don't want to be no repped in the kingdom. Can you no rep the kingdom? I don't know, but I think so. Um, because I do think God will make you do things over and over and over and over and over again until you get it. Um, cause that's just, I mean, it's who he is. He's like, no nah, girl, you got to get this down first. We can't move there yet. So I hope that's encouraging. I hope that it's challenging. I hope you have the best day. I love you guys so much. Thanks for being you. Do not no rep your life. Do it and do it right and do it the way you're supposed to do it and do it well, and do it with gladness, and joy, and have fun, and relax a little bit, but do it, dang, arise and go, I love you guys, catch you on the flip side, peace!